I'm Nick Stonecipher. And I'm Braden Dyerson. This is the Wrap Round Spring Break Edition. So do you have any plans for spring break? Yeah, so I'm actually taking a trip with a bunch of guys in my major, uh, a bunch of people in my major to uh, Bandon Dunes in Oregon, which uh, is super exciting. You know, I'm going to go with you know a bunch of my closest friends and play a lot of golf, so that's exciting. Did you intend to have, like, a boring spring break to try to, like, refresh you for going back into the semester? <laughs> I mean, this is going to be, like, probably the highlight of my year. What are you planning on breaking this spring? Uh, breaking lots of course records, you know, mm -hmm. stuff like that, yeah. Course records. What's your handicap? Uh, I am a two and a half, but depending on if you, when you ask me, probably like an eight right now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm legally deaf. Yeah. So that's kind of what I'm yeah. <laughs> working with. Um, yeah. and anyway, what are you doing for spring break this year? I'm going to Rome with my friends. When you get there, are you going to say when in Rome? <laughs> I don't think so. Why not? So do you have any plans for spring break this year? Um, I'm driving back home to Idaho. Oh, all the way back to Idaho? 40 hour drive. That's crazy. And what is there even to do in Idaho, you know? Home. Eat some potatoes? Yeah, lots of them. Nice. What are you planning to do for this 40 hours? Are you going straight? Um, straight through, I sleep for six hours, lots of music, mainly. Mm. Loud, loud music. Mm. Groovy. I'm getting tired just like hearing about this spring break. So what are your plans for spring break this year? Um, I plan on visiting my friends who go to other colleges who have different spring breaks and then I also plan on going home and seeing my dogs. What schools do they go to? Um, I have one friend that goes to University of Delaware and then I have another friend who goes to Westchester. So of all the places on planet Earth you could have chose to go this year, you chose the state of Delaware. Any reason why? I'm from Delaware. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you uh, give me one redeeming quality about Delaware? Um, it has really nice beaches. Uh, so do you have any plans for spring break this year? Yeah, I'm going to Miami. Going to Miami? Yeah. Going to Florida? Yep. Have you ever been to Miami before? No. Yeah, it's an experience. What are you planning on doing in Miami? Uh, beaches and stuff, probably. Mm -hmm. What's your opinion on Florida? I don't know. I heard there's crocodiles there. Yeah. Dad yeah, would watch out. Yeah. I was like, Miami, Miami's full of them. Yeah, I'm interested in mm -hmm. seeing one. So, um, any other plans other than celebrating your birthday? You know, where are you going to be? Um, also going to be just showing my friends from here who aren't from Pittsburgh around town. So, yeah. So you're from Pittsburgh? Yep. Um, what are, like, some common, like, Pittsburgh phrases that you might hear at Penn State here? I know, like, some people from, like, Homewood say, like, homies or, like, yins. What does yins mean? But I'm pretty sure it's, like, to refer to people, like, in the same way you say y'all. Gotcha. So do you think that came about because, like, all the people working with steel in Pittsburgh, you know, some, like, would fall on their head and they came up with yins instead of y'all? I'm Nick Stonecipher. And I'm Brayden Harrison. And this has been the Wraparound Spring Break Edition. Be sure to subscribe to all of our social media platforms and enjoy the time off. And shout out to Nick for being the next editor-in-chief at the Daily Collegian. Let's go!